Welcome back to Daughters of Ash, everyone. I almost like forgot what the name of this game is. Well, it's Dark Souls, obviously, but it's also Daughters of Ash. All right, we are back in this bonfire where there's normally no bonfire. I just turned the volume down a little bit because last episode there was some echoing because I'm, you know, I have my earphone kind of propped over one of my ears so that it's exposed my ear you know because you know it's weird not hearing your own voice if you are recording and if I have headphones on completely I won't hear my I should, why am I what am I doing here uh, you know I can't hear my own voice and it's really strange like that but otherwise okay I get an echo Eco, echo, an Amazon echo. Anyways, I'm just gonna go and see what's up the tower. Again, the rate of exploration, there's nothing. There's never been anything up in this tower, I think I just realized. Uh, so that was completely pointless. It's all good though. Another thing I'm almost guaranteed of betting on it that there is no black knight down here there's just doggos ah doggo two doggos it's a highly all right come up here did they just go i just ATAT'd him i went between the legs why am i he's close to me there's no Absolutely. What the fuck was that? Did you see that dude? He did a Korean backdash from Tekken. Unbelievable. Uh, this is also definitely not going to be the blue tear stone. It's a broken sword. Yeah, I mean, black knight, blue tear stone, two dogs, broken sword. Feels, you know, about equal in value. Yeah, there's never been anything here either. All right. Well, you know, there isn't really anything else to do but move forward. Um, regarding to the first episode, I'm glad you guys liked it. I'm gonna like really pump out the series for now because, well, first of all, number one, the boy enjoys playing this game. Second of all, Fuck off, mouse. I don't know. If, I'm going to have to check if that... Why does my mouse creep back into the screen? I don't know. It's a little bit, a little bit annoying, but hey, a little mouse on the screen never hurt anyone. That's another challenge I might do one of these days. Keyboard and mouse souls. Hell no, I'm not doing that. That's like... Oh, shit. He's gonna... Oh, God damn it. I had a feeling. So... It's a reverse, you know. They're coming through the back door. He's coming through the back door. The poop shoot. You know. Uh... This guy is generally easy. I say as I get crushed by his massive schlong of a weapon. I've made a lot of gross references. It's gonna be one of those episodes. At least, you know, the fact that they changed this to here means my chance of getting like yeeted off the edge is a lot less present, you know. Fuck. If I die to this boss, that's gonna be embarrassing still because like the bosses are unchanged. So, you know. If I die to any of these dudes, it's just gonna be... Oh, fuck you. Is that... Is it dragon flying? It's the dragon. So, here's the deal. Either that's a glitch, or I'm gonna kill this dude. 
and the dragon ain't gonna do shit. Horned chaos. What is all this shit I'm getting? Uh, I should read it. I got stuff from the previous boss as well. Damn, I gotta sneeze. Burn, burn with great strength. What? Mote of crimson fire taken from the heart of a demon of chaos. The bull demons were once the rock scaling guardians of the sacred molten rivers of Isolith, which off. Okay, yeah. Okay, there's just a weird font. I was gonna say there is a space between off and ten. There's a typo, but there isn't. Often ran red with both magma and the blood of four hardy pilgrims. Crush the flame to temporarily gain demonic strength, but be wary of bearing the infernal heat of chaos. Oh shit, are these like... Augments? The instincts for Wayfaring and Gary shows a force were not dulled by transfiguration. Crush the flame to temporarily gain immense stamina. Alright, here's the deal. I can already tell it's gonna be like... Megalixir. Uh, it's a Megalixir type situation from Final Fantasy, you know, where it's gonna be like, I'm not gonna use them because I'll save them for something significant and then I won't use them through the entirety of the game. That's really good. That's really cool. Uh, I don't know what icon they use for this. I think this is the... I'm gonna walk off the cliff. It's the Rite of Kindling icon, if I'm not mistaken. The corpse is gone. I also got the Watchtower key, which is needed for this, right? No, it's not. So either I'm mistaken about what the Watchtower key is. Alright, Solaire, the Bre, is still here. I'm gonna do... I'm gonna do Solaire, first of all, that's just natural, but I'm also gonna do Solaire's questline. I mean, how could you not? You know that boy be down with it. And that, <laughs> that fucking son, that son is... I wanna get... Oh. God damn it, the shine on it. That is one of the funniest faces. Like, how could... <laughs> that son is hilarious. <laughs> oh, man. It, it always makes me smile. Solaire's son. Yeah, 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 okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Again, online doesn't work. Uh, and you have the chance of... Risk of... Getting banned, oh fuck. Alright. Excuse? Excuse. Oh damn. It's like... Hold, but wait, wait a second though. There's no way you're gonna get through this. Hold on a second. The key. That's the watchtower. Yes! And that's my dog barking in the background. I think I know what we have to do. There ain't no way in hell we're getting through that dragon. But the watchtower is right there. Which means... Oh, this is... They're forcing you into the basin early on. I like it. I like it. Because if I'm going to be honest with you, I don't normally touch this watchtower. It's kind of a useless area when you think about it. I mean, Havel is there. <laughs> Just get off the edge, bitch. You know, that's about it. <clears throat> you know, playing this game, holy shit, I think that was something crazy going on with the camera. Uh, this game always is, never mind, yeah, just don't touch, the, oh, because this doesn't have a door on it, does it? I think that's why. Uh, 
I was gonna say, you know, I was gonna get all sappy here. This game is always, you know, good for nostalgia. I remember my first playthrough, you know. I remember it. Oh, this fool. He's here. I was just about to say there's no way Havel is gonna down, be down here. Look at that <laughs> low tier ass texture on the stuff on this table. I'm assuming you have the same shit to sell. Yes, you do. He do oh the pickaxe. See, I don't remember if he always used to sell the pickaxe or not. Uh, it doesn't really matter. But he does have standard arrows, which Megusta standard arrows. Gonna pump myself up before people get angry with me for not using. I'm only. I'm gonna stop talking about that. I swear. Don't even mind. What the hell I'm saying? All right. The dr the dragon's ravine. The old wilderness. Yeah, they changed the area names. They went all poetic with them. They have subtitles and everything. And no crystal golems, which thank fuck because on oh, these dudes. I'm gonna be honest with you, those crystal golems are one of the stupidest enemies in this entire game. Uh, they have dumb movesets. They look dumb. It's just, you know, bad news. Oh, this, I forgot, this doesn't make you fat roll. This makes you completely unable to roll. And that's why I hate these enemies. Oh, thank, thank fuck that missed. And just went through the earth. The earth, you know. God damn it. Thing is, I don't normally fight these dudes with a plus zero weapon. Normally, I thought he was dead. Normally I'm at a point where I can just like destroy them. See, the thing is, I'm just not thinking. I have a lot of souls. Like this is, okay. Oh no. This asshole. This homing. He has the homing shots on that Sega Genesis water, you know. But seriously, the texture on that, that is a bunk ass texture. And I just nearly walked off the cliff. I was gonna say, initially, before I was interrupted, this is probably one playthrough where I do not want to lose my uh, souls. Yeah, this is bad news. Just because, you know, it seems like leveling up might actually be going to get your feet, bitch. No, no, I'm not. That does, like, no damage. The compound bow or some shit. Yeah. Man, that made it sound like it hit a tin can. Go for your magic. Come on. Cool. You fight enemies you never ever fight. Like these dudes, again, like by the time I get to their area, they can't even stand up. I'm done with them. Now the question is, is the bonfire gonna be down there? Oh, there's more. I was just about to say. Hella weak to it. They must be weak to like thrust. Oh, people, by the way, thanks for the weapon suggestions. Well, I got one weapon suggestion. Uh, it was for a spear. Are people going to be mad at me if I use a spear? Probably not. Spears are like not in the so OP.
yes is that the first i think that is the first death and i couldn't have really i couldn't have asked for a more perfect first death it's like that was poetic you know you know this is why i'm an expert at no death runs it's because i don't make those types of mistakes in fact Never mind. Never mind. I did just roll off a cliff. Just whoosh, down we go. I really like gotta not lose these souls. That's like 8500, I think. 8500. Where's that first fool at? Oh, he's there. So hopefully he doesn't aggro. Man, I cannot believe it. That's like some baby shit, the way I died. Oh, no. That is the funniest death sound. Oh, this is bad. Muy mal, as they say in Espanol. Man, I haven't spoken Spanish in so long. I used to be fairly, like, proficient. I mean, I still probably wouldn't starve, you know, in Spain. But, you know, why even talk about that? Ain't nobody going anywhere anytime soon. I'll just say that much. And because of this, because me being an idiot and being flustered by dying... I don't actually remember what the fuck we picked up. We sure picked up something. Because that item is grayed out. We gotta go through these guys. There's no, you know... <clears throat> no way around it, excuse me. Yes, I am using this tactic now. Hey, it's hella efficient, you know. Except when I... No! Why, why are you doing that? Why are you doing that? And these guys are fast. What is this? Oh, I got a stoner greatsword. Nice. The issue is... This ain't exactly... Like, look at you look at this dude... He doesn't exactly scream greatsword user, does he? Uh, so I'm probably not going to go for it. In fact, I'm 100% not going to go for it. Which means I can liquidate it in the bottomless box. Speaking of, I never end up getting the bottomless box. But it is useful for inventory management. So maybe this will be... This will be the playthrough that I finally learned to use the bottomless box. Oh, look at that. Nice. These low tier motherfuckers are flying around everywhere. Actually, those guys are not low tier. Wait, does it actually link together like that? Are we seeing the drakes from the Valley of the Drakes or they just slapped some in the background? They're is a bonfire here which means I'm not going to use my last humanity but I am gonna level up uh, that's quite a it's quite a bit so I got a, got an attunement slot already cool I'm happy with that this is going to be a dex build. Giant Dad is crying right about now. Sorry, Giant Dad. Kind of had a feeling. All right, they're definitely pushing me towards one particular direction. Wait, now that I've increased my endurance. No. Nah. Apparently, these gloves are made of uh, like steel or something. 
anyways yeah so back to what i was saying earlier the first episode good reception glad you guys enjoyed it i mean i you know what fuck you i certainly okay maybe not fuck you i certainly enjoyed recording yesterday's i'm enjoying recording this too and you know i want to get back into the youtube grind a little bit more what even is the point of there isn't even an item there fuck that you know <laughs> like no way uh, I want to get into the YouTube grind a little bit more, which is what I was going to say. Um, you know, kind of focusing on the channel, using YouTube strategy, you know, which you got to use uh, to get some new people in, some more views, you know. Some people are like really, really against... What the fuck is going on? Sometimes my mouse moves, but por que? Like, I ain't moving it. I ain't paying attention to the game either. This is some... This is some ghost shit. This is some... Better get the exorcist in here. Throw the holy bong water around. And see what happens. If my head starts spinning in the next stream, just don't worry. Uh... You know, like some people really hate the quote unquote clickbaity. Wait, this is different, right? Titles, but hey, YouTube 2020 is a fucking massacre ground. Like, you gotta do everything in your power to get them views. And, you know, I've decided that I'm not gonna care about that. Like, I used to care about that. Up until recently, too. I'm like, ah, yeah, let's not. You know, let's not make these clickbaity titles because uh, it's not me. It's hella gonna be me from now on. Like, again, like, I'm saying like a lot. My vocabulary is quickly falling apart. But, again, this is a harsh environment. This is Mad Max out here, which in a couple of months it might be Mad Max in the real world as well. I'm only joking. Up until then, we might as well do YouTube. But seriously, yeah. Just looking into... This is a type of channel care as well. You know, just paying attention to it and just... You know, not letting it slowly fade. Because all channels slowly fade. It's just natural that all the... 13,000 whatever people that subscribed to me over the past you have I feel betrayed I feel I, I truly feel betrayed this was this game is never gonna have my trust again never Cause I was just about to say are they really gonna force me to use this bonfire so again, as I was saying, it's only the way of the world that all the people have subscribed over the years sometimes drift off or slowly drift off. I mean, I don't watch half the channels I'm subscribed to because, you know, I subscribe to them like, oh, thanks, something I'm never going to use. Subscribe to them like what, six years ago. Of course, you're... Uh, tastes and what type of videos you like. I'm not gonna go in there. Change over many years. But you know, that's why you gotta Moonlight Grow. This is a separate area. Uh, that's why you gotta bring in the new people. And again, I've been kind of not focused on that. But that's about to change. It's also gonna change in terms of type of content. I'm gonna... I heard the ambush. That's still here. Oh, fuck. Luckily, the boy hella stacked with purple moss. And this is something I always say that I'm also gonna broaden my content a little bit, but now I actually will because one of my main issues with 
like IRL videos and vlogs and all that was that my old phone's camera was kind of ass and logging around my Canon DSLR is a bit of a chore setting it up you know it doesn't have manual focus it can I mean it doesn't have autofocus it can only record for uh, 30 minutes in intervals but now I got a new phone just got it two days ago and it's pretty good it's got a good camera it's got all the shit you want I'm really afraid to go in there uh, so you know fuck. so you know making other types of videos is gonna be way easier speaking of I still owe you guys the car vlog which is gonna happen I'll probably shoot it on Saturday yeah Saturday I'll go out for a night-ish drive listen I pay my dues you know when I say a video is coming a video is coming this like channel improvement stuff also gonna extend into streaming as well uh, I think I'm gonna do Binding of Isaac we had a discussion on the discord this is 100% the boss here like yeah the bosses don't change maybe they're apparently he introduced some tricks with the bosses but their actual positioning doesn't change so <sighs> I was gonna say before being interrupted for the I don't know what time is that I think we have a consensus that I'm gonna play Binding of Isaac as a stream game that's gonna be starting Saturday this is the fuck how long have I been going I'm not paying attention to my time am I okay we're still okay generally I feel you know because I am a pro youtuber I feel you know like 30 minutes I feel it it's in my blood I can smell 30 minutes and that wasn't 30 minutes yet we're a bit short I knew it I was just about to say some shit is gonna go down I really hate these enemies so yeah I think we agreed on Binding of Isaac which people been wanting to see and it's actually I've noticed that Binding of Isaac is kind of a terrible game for uh, episodic type content because shit just sometimes goes wrong uh, with me who's not that good at the game shit goes wrong more often than it goes right which makes it really boring when you wait for a I knew it twink tight night I'm gonna if you think I'm finding another one of these fools you are mistaken so to me it looks like there's no other way to go but back because I thought the bonfire would be here but it's not it could also be in the area where you get the the wolf ring normally but that's just the game theory you know well that's a channel that fell off didn't it is that dude still around probably yes but that shit got old look at me criticizing other YouTube channels doesn't matter game theory oh. <laughs> is that crystal fool is following me still I'm gonna I don't know what I'm gonna do I mean, technically it could be that the bonfire we were at is the bonfire for this place which means there's a fog gate here did they put some boss here? there's a chance they put a boss here I'm like running 
What the hell is that? Where, where did you come from? This dude just like hella popped out of nowhere. Yeah, resource wise. This fella ain't doing too good. You know what? I'm gonna edge you guys. Uh, this is edging. I'm gonna go back and wrap up the episode here. Episode 2 of Daughters of Ash. Things are going down. At least I have humanity to rekindle myself. Which really doesn't do anything because I'd have to spend both of it to get more Estus. But still, being human is better than not being human because you get full HP. Which I like. Fuck off, mouse. I, I actually like that. I've always thought, or I've always enjoyed the Souls games where dying actually had more of an impact than just you looking dead. I'll wrap it up here. Sorry for the cock block in terms of whatever is behind that fog gate. I'm assuming it's like Capra Demon or something. Like, they must have moved the boss. Yeah, we'll wrap it up here. Peace out, guys. See you tomorrow with this. You don't have to wait too long, technically. Yeah, like, comment, and subscribe. Do all that. Peace out.